pandemic has brought about some highly strange behaviour in the light of safety regulations that we're all supposed to follow. A few days back, a woman was seen and filmed removing her knickers stroke thong to use as a face mask in a supermarket. No, people, you did hear me correctly. The woman who entered a supermarket without a face covering was caught on camera taking off her thumb and using it as an impromptu mask. The unidentified woman wrapped her black underwear around her head after being warned by a security guard at a pick and pay supermarket in South Africa that she wouldn't be served without one. She then pulls up her underwear and other shoppers react with shock. One shopper can be heard repeating what's going on. Well, another approach her brilliant ingenuity. The shopper behind yells, personally, I find that acceptable. It is a mask. Quite frankly, I think the bacteria on your knickers is less than on the mask. So well done. But others weren't as impressed. One social media user commented, This makes me sick. We're sick with a serious virus, and she thinks a G3 will save her. Another shopper added, They should not allow her into shop without a mask in the first place. It's disgusting, to say the least. No, this though. The woman in this video wasn't the first ever person to reach for her underwear when finding herself in a tight spot without a mask. In Kiev, Ukraine, a woman was recorded removing her leggings and underwear to create a makeshift mask after being told you should have known the rules by now. You must wear a face mask while queuing in the post office. Meanwhile, in Dublin, Ireland, a man was spotted wearing a pair of white front underpants on his face on board a train. Although many countries have implemented compulsory mask wearing in public places during the pandemic, very few have defined face coverings in a way that precludes repurposing undergarments. Enjoy the video, folks. <laughs> Wanted by police handed himself in so he wouldn't have to spend more time in lockdown with the people he lived with. Officers said the man was wanted for recall to prison and gave himself up at Burgess Hill Police Station on Wednesday afternoon to get some peace and quiet. Inspector Darren Taylor from Sussex Police explained to reporters the wanted man cited peace and quiet requested for his reason for handing himself back into the police. He informed us he would rather go back to prison than have to spend more time with the people he was living with. So... Work in custody and heading back to prison to serve some further time on his own. All in a day's work. A survey released in October found more than half the population, 53%, said they had felt angry with other people they know because of their behaviour in relation to the coronavirus pandemic. 
According to the research by King's College London, nearly a quarter of the population reported having argued with friends or family about their actions amid COVID-19 restrictions. With one in twelve no longer speaking to a friend or relative because of disagreements.